Hi friends, how many of you have heard about Kohinoor diamond? Do you know it has got 5000 years of significance? Actually it was known as Samantakamani 5000 years back when Krishna was there in Dwapara Yuga. It, this uh, diamond was there in Dwapara Yuga and it was popularly known as Samantakamani in those days. But now it is kept in British Museum. And now it is known as Kohinoor Diamond. We must know the story. In Dwapara Yuga, there was a king named Satrajit. He meditated so deeply and Surya Bhagavan was pleased for his meditation and presented him this money named this money. Money means diamond. He gave this diamond to Satrajit. And this diamond was so glittering and the whole place, the entire place was glittering with its divinity. And every day, the speciality of this diamond is every day it was producing 8 cages of gold. That was the speciality of this Samantakmani. The story of Samantakmani is the counterpart of Vigna Nivarka Chaturdi. After performing the puja, we have to listen to this Great story, Samantakamani. In what way is this story, Samantakamani, related to Vigna Nivarka Chaturdi? For knowing that, you have to watch this till the end. Here is the king named Satrajit, who was blessed by sun god for his deep meditation. And he presented him, he presented Satrajit a beautiful diamond named Samantakamani. Every day it was producing 8 cages of gold. Once Lord Krishna visited Satrajit. He was fascinated by the beauty, by the glow of Samantakamani. And he wanted to feel the gem. He wanted to feel the stone. And he also asked permission to show it to his grandfather named Ugrasen. But Satrajit didn't agree. One day, his brother named Prasenajit wore it and went for hunting. But he didn't come back. Satrajit started suspecting Lord Krishna. Krishna was called for. Krishna realized that he was blamed unnecessarily for not performing Vigna Nivarka Chaturdi. He himself wanted to know the fact. So, with the soldiers of Satrajit, Lord Krishna went into the forest. There he found the dead body of Prasenajit. He found the scratches of a lion all over his dead body. And even Samantakmani was not found. Then Krishna thought, lion might have killed him and might have taken Samantakmani into its cave. He found the footprints of the lion and he followed the lion footprints along with the soldiers. After reaching some place, lion's footprints were stopped and he found the dead body of a lion. Where the lion footprints were stopped, from there started bear's footprints. A bear might have killed that lion and might have taken the Samantakamani to its cave. So, he along with the soldiers followed towards the cave. After reaching the cave, it was so dark inside. The soldiers were so scared and stopped outside. But Krishna entered the cave very bravely. Inside the cave, he found a beautiful baby holding that playing with that Samantakmani in the cradle. The caretaker of the baby, suspected Lord Krishna, went out to call the bear named Jambavanta. The whole bear started fighting with Lord Krishna. This fight was so fierce and it lasted for 28 days. The soldiers who were standing outside thought Krishna might have been killed by the bear and went back to Satrajit to inform him what had happened all these days. The bear was gradually losing its stamina. Then it realized 
द वन हू केम टू फाइट विथ हिम इज नन अदर दैन लॉर्ड ड्रामा इन त्रेता युगा हु केम एज लॉर्ड कृष्णा नाउ टू फाइट विथ हिम ही फेल ऑन लॉर्ड कृष्णा स्वीट एंड सेट दीज वर्ड्स यू वर माई रामा इन त्रेता युगा I made a challenge with you I wanted to fight with you but as Rama you said that in the next incarnation that you would come as Krishna and fight with him with me so you are none other than Lord Narayana himself who came to this world as Rama in Treta Yuga and as Krishna in Dwapara Yuga he gave Samanta Kamani and also his daughter jambavati in marriage with krishna with that samantakamani krishna went back to satrajit and handed over that precious stone to satrajit satrajit repented for his act of suspecting lord krishna and handed over samantakamani and he said you are the eligible person to get this samantakamani he said and he also gave his daughter Satyabama in marriage with Krishna See friends if we take the outer meaning of it of this story we have to perform vigna nivarka chaturthi and should wear akshatas on our head otherwise we will be blamed unnecessarily that's the curse given by Parvati mata to the moon who laughed at her son Krishna saw the moon without wearing these akshatas If we take the inner meaning of it Krishna being almighty he did not need to face all these circumstances but he wanted to prove that whenever we come to this world though lord also should follow all rules and regulations laid by our shastras another one is whenever we come across any difficult situations we should not escape from the situations we have to face the situations bravely then success will be ours as rama he could not fulfill the desire of jambavanta because he helped rama in finding out sita in fetching sita so he did not want to fight with jambavanta during that time so he promised him that he would fight with jambavanta in next incarnation that was krishna so in this way he fulfilled the desire of jambavanta also let's come with another interesting topic in our next video till then bye jai shri manarayana